I have a breaking news about Toyota and Tesla friends. One of its top executives sets a date when Toyota will be like Tesla, 100% electric vehicle. Welcome back everyone. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. If you are here first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla electric vehicle news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next report. The question on everyone's mind is when exactly is Toyota going all electric? Toyota Motor Europe's chief operating officer recently gave Gave some insights into when the automaker could be planning to sell 100% electric vehicles. After establishing itself as a pioneer in hybrid technology with the introduction of the Prius in 1997, Toyota has fallen behind in fully electric vehicle technology. With newly elected CEO Koji Sato at the helm, Toyota has accelerated its electric vehicle strategy with a series of announcements over the past few weeks. Although Toyota is sticking with a hybrid strategy, including uh, plug-in hybrid electric vehicles and fuel cell vehicles, FCEVs, the Japanese automaker has recognized the urgency of having fully electric models in its lineup, just like Tesla has. Toyota revealed it would develop its own dedicated electric vehicle platform to power its next generation electric vehicles. The platform, set to be launched in 2026, corresponds with its newly announced electric vehicle battery technology plans, which I've reported at Torque News YouTube channel before. By 2027, Toyota aims to have two next generation electric vehicle batteries, a performance and popularized versions. Compared to the battery used for the BZ4X, Toyota says its next generation batteries will increase driving range by 20% with a 20% to 40% cost reductions. Isn't it cool? This is serious competition coming to for Tesla, at least in the level of announcements, increasing range by 20% and cutting the cost by 20 to 40%. The news came shortly after several Toyota shareholders said they planned to vote to oust chairman Akio Toyota over the automaker's failure to set a date to go all electric. So is Toyota going 100% electric vehicle in Europe by 2035? This is the date Toyota executives set to catch up with Tesla in that regard. During an interview at Automotive News Europe Congress, Toyota Europe COO Matt Harrison explained the automaker does not support the Euro 7 standard proposed by the EU to slash harmful emissions. The Euro 7 part of the European Green Deal is the EU's latest vehicle exhaust emissions standard designed to support ultra-low emissions with stricter regulations. Harrison said he expects the new regulation to be something more realistic or toned down. The current standards require automakers to reduce CO2 emissions by 55% by 2030 compared to 2001 as a base level. Toyota Europe's leader forecasts Toyota's EV share in Europe to rise from 0% in 2022 to 15% in 2025 and 55% in 2030. Harrison added, we will be ready to sell 100% battery electric vehicles from 2035. If Toyota is going to do this in Europe by 2035, making all vehicles it sells 100% electric, will Toyota be able to do that in other markets of the world? This is when I think Toyota will catch up with Tesla at least becoming all electric vehicle company just like Tesla is today. As far as localizing production in Europe, Harrison claimed there is no point in localizing until we are at the right scale and at 15% in 2025. We wouldn't be there yet far. He added the Japanese automaker has no plans to produce electric vehicle batteries in Europe in the near term. However, in the future, it could be a possibility. So, I kind of get too excited, but there is reason not to get too excited. Toyota's Europe leader is essentially claiming if they are forced to go 100% electric by EU regulations, it will be ready. I mean, even if you are forced to go, you have to hire people, you have to set up the standards and platforms and everything. You have you are forced to do more research and that will may that may be productive, right? From Harrison's comments, it still doesn't sound like Toyota is thrilled about the idea of going all electric, but it is acknowledging it as a possibility. 
Either way, 100% electric by 2035 is still late to the game. And if Toyota doesn't begin moving production capabilities to support electric vehicles, it could risk falling further behind. Toyota is targeting 1.5 million in electric vehicle sales by 2026 with 10 new models which would amount to roughly 14% of sales based on 10.5 million in 2022 cars. While many automakers are already achieving double digit of 100% electric vehicle sales, Toyota continues investing in, um, some people say, inferior hybrid and fuel cell technology, which will likely delay its transition further. So what do you think, friends? Toyota is going to be in uh, all electric in Europe in 2035. What are the pluses and minuses? Too late? Wonderful? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, please. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Let's move on to our new coverage. Just for fun, Toyota is reportedly developing an electric vehicle with a manual transmission. I've never seen an electric vehicle with a manual transmission, but I think this is going to be fun. Welcome back, everyone. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Peter Valdez Dapena reporting in CNN says, for those who find electric cars a bit boring, Toyota engineers are working on a realistic feeling fake manual transmission as a possible future. To be clear, a manual transmission on an electric car would serve absolutely no purpose. It would be just for fun and add-on for people who like shifting gears in their gasoline-powered cars. Now, let me ask you a question before I move any forward with the details of Toyota's manual transmission electric vehicle. Would you prefer an electric vehicle with manual transmission versus automatic transmission? Please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I think this is really fun. Toyota, long skeptical of electric vehicles, has been planning a more aggressive push in the sector. That will mean finding ways to appeal to all sorts of consumers. A feature like this could have lure holdouts who aren't attracted to an electric vehicle's usual smoothness and simplicity, which I personally like. Even among gasoline-powered cars, most sold in the United States today have automatic transmissions that shift gears with no driver input. Manual transmissions in which a driver has to press a clutch pedal and move a stick around to select different gears are usually offered as options on performance cars or, in some cases, extremely cheap cars. They are more common in other parts of the world, through, like including Europe. Most electric cars uh, have only a one-speed transmission because their fast-spinning electric motors don't need the extra help from different gear rations, uh, ratios at different speeds. In Toyota's case, according to a patent application filed in the United States in late May, the car would have no actual multi-speed transmission. Instead, a shifter would be connected to sensors and a central computer programmed in mimic the feel of a car with a manual transmission. Since not all cars with manual transmissions are the same, they have different engines and different transmissions with different numbers of gears. The central computer will be programmed to imitate a specific sort of manual transmission car. To complete the experience, the driver will have a clutch pedal in addition to the usual brake and accelerator. Drivers will even be able to downshift a process also knowing, also actually known as engine braking. That's when the driver selects a lower gear and releases the clutch pedal without pressing the gas pedal at all. Then the friction of the unpro, um, unpowered engine slows the car without the driver having to use the brakes. Toyota's virtual manual transmission includes programming that will allow drivers to realistically experience using it badly up to a point. If the driver doesn't give it enough gas or selects the wrong gear, the car will shake and buck just like a gas-powered manual transmission car would. So this is going to be just like real manual transmission car, except it's going to be electric, which you won't find anywhere so far. The car's computer will limit how far the shaking will go to avoid stress on the battery. If the drivers don't feel like using the fake manual transmission, they don't have to. The car would have two driving modes, a regular EV mode and the Fox manual mode. 
How cool! Some reports on the technology have said there will also be fake engine sounds to go along with a, the shifting and accelerating actions, although the patent application doesn't mention it. So far, it's unclear if, when, and in which global markets the fake shifting electric vehicle from Toyota might be sold. Toyota declined to provide additional details to CNN when they requested it. What do you think, friends? I think this is very cool, don't you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section if you would like an electric vehicle from Toyota with manual transmission, which is fake but looks very real. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla electric vehicle Toyota news. God bless you, everyone, and let's move on to our next story.